All right, guys, sorry about that. I don't know where I lost you, but the heat, it's almost 100 degrees here and I was in the sun too much. I've been in the shade letting my phone cool down. So that's what happened. We've got a, uh, a technical failure. So we'll see if anybody comes on, comes back. Bum, bum, bum. Well, we'll probably just call it. I do want to get this last part in though. So you guys can watch this as it gets recorded. It's almost 100 degrees and my phone just, it just shut down. So I've been, like I said, I've been in the shade here. Uh, sorry about that. All right, we've got 16 people. So I'm gonna have to wrap it up, but there was one grave. There were a couple of graves that I wanted to show you guys. Well, let's just, um, let's see if a few more people come over and I'm gonna stay in the shade. So again, for those of you that just got on here, major technical problem. The phone overheated, just plain overheated. And now everything is, all the comments are upside down. I don't know, this YouTube sometimes. You know, when technology works, you'll love it, right? That's what they say. And when it doesn't, it's the most frustrating thing. So I can't see the comments. I see there's 20 folks back with us, 32. Sorry about that, guys. Camera overheated and just shut down. So I'm just going to do a short segment here to wrap up. here at Mount Olivet Catholic Cemetery. I'm gonna pop back out in the sun so this phone, and then I'm gonna pop back in the shade so the phone doesn't overheat like it did before. It's an interesting statue, the bird's nest. I popped over here because this is the grave of Terence Drugan who was a Irish gangster. I did an episode called the Fox Lake Massacre where his brother was shot up. Many of the guys were killed, Capone guys. He was a Capone ally, but I'll put a link in uh, when I get time. A link on that episode, but here at the bottom, terrible Terry machine gun, Drugan. And there's a couple of good pictures of him. What a character. All right, let's get back in the shade. I don't want to lose this phone again. So what happened for those of you that came back, thank you, we got 50 folks. The phone just died. It was not the battery, it was heat. It was pure and simple heat. That's never happened to me before. So sorry about that. I'm marching over this way. I'm gonna wrap it up at this grave of two, a brother and a sister here at Mount Olivet Catholic Cemetery. There's the bench. You know what they call that sometimes? They call that the devil's bench. All right, so what we have up here, I'm gonna, uh, by the fence is a brother and sister. I think they are of Czech or Lithuanian heritage cannot read the writing, but the dates show that they died within a few months of each other. And so the little girl, A-H-H-A, 11-28-1916, she's two, year old, two years or so older than her brother, and she died and looks like June of 1922, and her brother died in August? 11, no, 11 would be November, 1922. So they both died, maybe, maybe Deb or Ancestry. Any of you guys look this up, if you can, I don't even know if it's on Find a Grave. There's the last name, I'd love to know how they died. 
I'm sure it was disease. But what a beautiful pair, huh? Yeah, they both died when they were little. So like six years old, uh, the girl was close to, I'm not, not gonna split hairs, around six years old, and then the boy was about four years old, it looks like, depending on months and dates. So again, sorry everybody for what, uh, the phone, I just gotta notice the phone shut down. It's about 100, it's almost 100 degrees here. I was out in the sun too long, I guess, and the phone just shut down. So, I, I'm gonna actually wrap it up here. And I hope you guys, hope we can see you tonight. If anybody has time at eight o'clock central time, I will be doing, let me see if I can flip this around. Here we go. So at eight o'clock tonight, I'm gonna be, I've got that premiere coming out on Dr. Timothy Clark Smith. So I'll see you guys there, whoever can make it. And again, just to conclude, we've got a video episode every single day this week, Monday through Friday in Vermont, every day, in sequence how I did the trip. And thanks for hanging around. I'm sorry my phone had, it overheated and it just shut down. So I've been in the shade here cooling it down. I'm fine. I'm absolutely fine. There's not a lot of humidity, but this t technology just doesn't work sometimes. So. See you guys around. Thanks for coming back <laughs> for this little part two, this little five minute part two. And uh, I'll catch you guys soon. All right. And thanks for coming out. Stay safe. All right. All right. See ya.